it's too much. Hi friends and welcome to a new video. Uh, today I want to show you my favorite makeup of the month. So if you want to see how I realized this makeup, just follow the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And now let's get on with the video. I discovered some products during the Black Fridays and I ordered some products here and there and I discovered that, oh my God, like these products are just amazing. So I will start by hydrating my skin because it's very important. It's key to have a very hydrated skin in order to layer all the products on top of each other to have the perfect base. Second, we need to dump the beauty sponge. This is damped because it makes like a huge difference when it's wet from when it's dry. Like it has to be super, super soft. And then I will layer um, some very, very nice products that I discovered are insanely amazing uh, and they work super well with my skin, but I'm sure it will work with the right shade with everybody because it's just unbelievable. I will start by layering some uh, stuff. My skin is dry. I really don't know how because yesterday night I put all the lotions I could. Going now in with the under eye with Eucerin Hyaluronic Filler. This is very good very very good for fine lines so i'm just going with some around the eyes it's made on purpose for the under eyes and for the fine lines i wish they all worked like in one time <laughs> cannot be possible then i am layering the belief um this one is the brightening cream um I had some spots on my skin and really I got everything whitening that I could find in the market. And I'm layering, as you can see, so much lotion. Like so, so much. Don't be afraid because actually <laughs> it's too much. But it's okay because my skin really needs that. So. Don't be afraid to layer too much. I also layer one more product, uh, which is a stick that I'm really enjoying. Uh, Mr. Doctor, Mr. Dr. Belmore. It's a stick, but it's really good for as well uh, eye contour and is super hydrating. I'm also wearing it on the lips. So with this super hydrated skin, now we created our canvas and we can start layering the products. I'm not using a primer because our primer is this very glowy base and I'm applying the Huda Beauty Foundation. Um, this is called Toasted Coconut 240. This is a full coverage liquid foundation. It is full coverage, you will see. I will apply it on my hand like this and just start. You need to be just a little patient. <laughs> I also go in the under eye because I like the effect that it gives me in the under eye. Ah, so I got even the Glowish by Huda Beauty concealer and with the Black Fridays. This is number 1.5 Fair Cool and I believe it's perfect to brighten the under eye. So I will just wear some here. At the same time, I will let this dry and I will put the Rare Beauty Contour Stick here. This is the shade Bright Side. And on the nose, I will do under, then on top, here, and then on the sides. I'm also going on the sides of my forehead. I have to say I like this Rare Beauty, but it's too buttery. You can blend it very easily, but at the same time, it's too soft. I don't know, I believe it's not my favorite, to be honest. I, I heard very good things about it, but it's not my favorite. I'm gonna try the Makeup by Mario one and see if it's a bit different. After you blend everything, you should find like something like this. Sorry, my lashes are coming down. I really don't like it when they do this. 
you know what happens they do the lashes and then I remove them and when I'm tired of them when they start to get off and stuff and I get bothered I remove them and then my own lashes fall off so whenever she puts them back in they go like this because they don't have my lashes to attach on so <sighs> what to do I'm using my favorite powder now by Colossus this is a pressed powder super cool that if you want the best blurring effect you're gonna use this powder puffs angled and go in this corner right here see like the difference is incredible natural result I'm going also in the forehead and here I'm going to get the Charlotte Tilbury applied on top of the contour stick another of my favorite products I want to try the whole collection I don't know when because it's super expensive but it's the hourglass and this is the blush um, and ambient strobe lightning brush you don't need to put a highlighter as well because this one first of all is super delicate and buildable uh, and it has a sheer in it so you don't need to to layer also a highlighter like if it's like a normal day like for me this is just perfect it looks so natural this is what I love about this product I'm using like a super big brush at the end just to mix um, everything together I'm gonna do my brows and come back and to do them I always use the Kiko this is the eyebrow sculpt the shade the 05 okay for the eyes I'm using the tartalette this is one of my favorite pal eye palette the colors are so easy and I'm taking this color right here and just wearing it on top of my eyelid everywhere and it takes two minutes literally five seconds per eye with the fluffy brush with circular motions and you're done and for lips I'm going in with the NYX lip pencil in the shade natural I tried to go outside a little bit of my lips and then then I color inside when I'm done I just take the Laneige lips mask and I just get some and wear it on top this hydrates your lips for the whole day and looks like lip gloss and that's it guys this is the makeup of today I really hope you like it uh, it's my favorite makeup of the month let me know what you think about it let me know if it's easy for you as well uh, let me know what you want to see next and um, I'll see you in the next video thank you so much for watching Mwah.